What's up? It's Mama T. How are y'all doing? It is your girl. I am back with another video. My goal is to get this video out to y'all quickly. This is literally going to be a workout video, a workout vlog. I'm going to go to the gym. I think I'm going to try to show y'all what I do when I work out. It's not like the best workout day. It's literally triceps and chest day. So it's not like the best workout. It's not. Um, my favorite days are like back and biceps and legs, leg days, of course, with glutes. That's like my favorite days. Chest and triceps is, is not my favorite day, but it's just an important. And I'll try to squeeze some ab work in it as well. So I'm about to go to the gym and get this workout in um, at my gym in my apartment. Okay. So hopefully y'all enjoy it. And, you know. Y'all see what I do in these 24 hours of me just like working out. I need to get some protein shakes. I might take y'all with me to get them a little bit later. And I also need some, I want to try a new restaurant, but I got food at home. <laughs> so enjoy this video. I'm about to work out. Y'all been seeing, y'all want to see what I do. So y'all better watch it. All right, so this is what I'm looking like. Can y'all see me? Hold on, let me move this so y'all can see me. This is what Mama T is looking like. I'll be working out with this little thing on because I'll be putting my phone in there so my, I can listen to my music. But um, this is how I'm looking. This is what the body is looking like right now. Um, there are improvements. Monroe gave me some pants that look really, really nice. I'm not wearing them. But um, that's pretty much what I'm... That's pretty much what I'm looking like. I'm feeling good. I had got discouraged, you know, losing weight consistently, even though it's like small numbers now, like, you know, it's not really that small, but it, it is small. When, when you like, when you're in your plan and you've been in your plan for a while, you'll lose like a pound here, pound there. It's not like five pounds or, you know, three pounds at a time, unless you weigh like every once a month. But you now if I weigh once a month, it'd be like seven or eight pounds. But I be weighing like every other day. So I'd be like one pound, a couple ounces, one pound, like three pounds a week, I guess. But anyways, but I did get discouraged, but I got over that real quick because I'm doing well. My body is changing. No, I'm not where I want to be, but I am moving. I'm closer to it now than I was before. So I'm just trying to stay motivated and I, I'm going to go have me a really good workout today and just hope that um, I continue to, you know, crush it and not get discouraged i'm noticing um look at that y'all y'all know y'all ain't never seen no collarbone ever look at that look at that thing y'all have never seen that on me well y'all probably haven't i lost weight the last time but it's not like a normal thing to see no collarbone with me especially not up here but that's what we got going on these arms are getting smaller i'm just wondering like what is it gonna look like like when i lose this weight and get in the best shape that I can possibly do without surgery, what is it going to look like? Like, is my stomach going to completely go away? Like, is this arm fat going to completely go away or am I going to have to get surgery for it? I've just been wondering that lately. What y'all think in the comments? Do y'all think it's going to go away? Let, let me show y'all. I'm going to show y'all one more time. Y'all can't really tell because I, I wear like a, um, I wear body shapers. I wear like gurgles. So like, you see all of this, but you can't really see it. Like it's it's a lot smaller, y'all, but it's still there. Like it's like it's like you know this right here, and this is getting smaller. But like my this back fat is like almost gone. But this like part right here, I'm just wondering like, is that gonna like really go down? Like is it gonna like really go away? Like is it gonna go away completely? Or is it going to just be there a little bit? I'm just wondering. But let me know in the comments. Yes. Yes. That's still up. Yes. Yes. It's still up. It's going to be gone. Okay. The next video, y'all see? I promise it's going to be gone. Okay. Because all this is gone. Okay. I just, just give me some time. Just give me, give me some time. But I'm about to go work out and I will talk to y'all later.
All right, you guys, I have speeded up my little workout and I'm bringing y'all with me for my workout. So right here, I'm just doing a little stretch here and there. I don't even remember what I was working this day. I'm not really sure. It might have been, oh, it was triceps and chest, I believe. Yeah, triceps and chest. Yep, that's what I'm doing. So it doesn't, it's not really that fast like it looks right here, but I, like I said, I had to speed it up because, you know, I didn't want to take forever. But we work in those triceps right here. This is also working the back of your arms, okay? It works really, really good. I love these workouts. I've gotten a lot of these workouts from a lot of my Instagram girls who lift weights. Um, right here, still getting those triceps and chest together. Um, my chest has gone down a lot. I'll show y'all a picture, a before picture, and what's, what it looks like right now a little bit later. But um, this was really, really hard. I mean, I was really struggling. Like, those facial expressions were the truth. <laughs> right here, I was like, no joke. I'm tired. But I came to do some more over here. And this is my gym where I live. Um, it's a nice gym. Really nice equipment. And I, I worked it out. But y'all know now I joined a gym. This video is, like, probably, like, two weeks old or a week old. This is something else that I got from a girl online from Instagram. It really helps you your stomach in those side rolls. Um, my stomach is, has gone down tremendously, you guys. And at one point, I dropped that thing, but I took it out. But I probably should have left it in because y'all probably would have got a kick out of that. But I was going. It looks like I'm going fast, but I'm not going that fast. <laughs> Did y'all work out today? What am I doing here? Oh, yeah, this is when you swing that that thing. Swing it. I was swinging that thing. That's also helping your stomach, your abs. What I pray I get one day. And right here, I'm still working on this stomach. Oh, so I did triceps, um, chest, and abs this day. That's what I did this day. Trying to get those love handles down to y'all. Well, I'll be working it out. I got one more, two more sets of what I just finished. Then I got, I'm got. i going to do the elliptical, I think, for 15 minutes, and then the treadmill for 15 minutes. Then I'm going to get out of here. I've been here for a minute. I did a really good tricep workout and ab workout oh oh no i might do a couple of things over there because there is something i want to do over there so we'll see if i go over there but i'm really trying to focus more on my abs and y'all know that i'm eating clean i might show y'all something i don't know what this video is going to be a workout with me and i don't know if y'all gonna see what i eat today maybe maybe not <laughs> but we'll see and this is the cardio. The last part of my workouts normally consist of the elliptical um, or the treadmill. Sometimes I do the bike. But as you can see, the smaller your back gets, the, the larger mm -mm, the booty looks. Not trying to be funny. I'm just being very serious. So we got to get all that fat off that back. But I had a great workout. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Workout today. Good morning. Hello, beautiful people. It's your girl. Mama T. You know my clothes right there. <laughs> I'm about to go to the gym. It's good Friday. It's Friday morning. I just took my bonnet off. Um, I was trying to explain to y'all this hair in that last video that I posted that everybody loved this hair. The reason why I do not like this hair is because it gets really, really tangled really bad. And y'all can't really tell right now because I had combed it yesterday and wet it after work because it, it, it gets tangled like a bird's nest by the end of the day, okay? Like for real. But I sprayed it down because I was going to go live and then I changed my mind. I, actually, I actually went live twice, but it kept saying I didn't get a connection. So now I was like, maybe it's just not meant to be. So I got offline, but I just took my bonnet off. I'm about to comb it and I'm about to go to the gym. I have not been motivated to work out this week. This week has been really rough for me with my eating and working out. And I'm just trying to stay focused. Ma'am? Okay. So I'm just trying to stay motivated. I am not really in the mood to go to the gym today at all. Y'all know like every month, sometimes women lose focus and motivation because of things that happen to their bodies. But this one has been really, really rough for me. Like, I really have been craving food that I should not be craving. Um, I have not been wanting to work out. I have worked out. Today is Friday. I had maybe one or two workouts this week. Like, seriously, y'all, the whole week. 
And I've been doing, and that's because last week I did, I just went really hard last week. Last week I worked out six straight days. So I can't do that. That that just made it really, that, that just exhausted me for this week, I think. So I'm not going to do that again. I'm going to stick with five days a week and have two day rest days. <sighs> so I'm up. I'm trying to get ready. I hope y'all are doing okay today. I hope y'all enjoyed my last video. I'm going to try to edit a video today of my workouts from that week when I was working out and try to just motivate myself to get back focused because my sister was like, you are at the point where you always stop. Don't stop this time. And she's right. Like, finish what I started. Like, my goal is to get in complete shape. I mean, have, that's bad. That's bad, my arm. I want muscles. <laughs> Like my arms are totally out of shape. Even though I exercise, they've gone, they've got a lot smaller. But baby, these things, they are so fat. But it's okay. Because we're working towards success. So let me comb my hair. Let me put my gym clothes on. And I will come back and talk to y'all once I am ready to go work out. But I called like I called about four or five people and nobody wants to go work out with me. And it just sucks because some days, even the people like me, because I'm like a person who loves to work out by myself. But days like this, I just be wanting somebody to work out with because I don't want to go. I need, I need somebody to go with me. But I'm about to go. I love y'all. All right, y'all. So I was like, I'm going to the gym. I'm going to make myself go, right? Nobody want to go with me, so I'm going to make myself go. Right after I get dressed, comb this hair out, do all that stuff, my stomach starts hurting. When I tell you the stomach starts hurting, the stomach starts hurting. But I'm not going to let that stop me. I am going to the gym because my stomach ain't hurt yesterday. It didn't hurt this morning. But until I got dressed to go to the gym, let me show y'all. It grew and pain just started coming from this thing. When I tell you the pain is sort of coming from this bloated, painful stomach. I turn around and look from the side because I want to see what it looked like, y'all. This stomach hurts. And the pain that I felt from the growing of the stomach. Oh, okay, I see you back there. Y'all, this bloated thing hurts, but I'm going to the gym regardless. I'm going. And guess what? My son is going with me. Ethan said, I'll go with you, mama. So I'm happy. Then I'm going to come home and clean up because the house needs to be clean. And we're taking that down today. That's what we're doing. We're going to get us something to eat when we leave the gym. And we're going to come home. And we're going to take this Christmas tree down. We need to come home. We need to go to the gym. We need to get something to eat. Then we're going to take this Christmas tree down. That's what we're doing today. I literally, I just crossed my leg and my stomach just felt so much pain. And, like, it wasn't hurting when I was laying on the couch. It wasn't even hurting when I said, let's go to the gym. But literally, when I got dressed to go to the gym, something wants to distract me from working out. And I really believe the Lord wants me to work out and be healthy. I don't think he wants me to, like, you know, get vain. And I don't think, I know he don't want me to, you know, start thinking, you know, I'm the sugar honey iced tea or start, you know, acting wild and out, acting silly, doing the most. But I know he wants me to have self-control. I know he wants me not to be having all my thoughts on food. And I know he, you know, I know he wants me to to be to take care of my temple that he gave me. But I know he wants me to take care of my body and have self-control and make good, healthy decisions with my food. So that's what I'm about to do. I'm about to go to the gym, give me something to eat, come home. And I talked to the Lord already this morning. Y'all, I read um, Daniel and the Lion's Den in the Bible. And that was so good. Like, please read that story. I'm going to put where you can find it right here. I'm not we even going to discuss it till later. Because I want you to stop right now. I'm going to put right here where to read it. I want y'all to read this story. And just see, like, how does this apply today? Same thing. People been hating. People been jealous. People been mad at people's favor. It's crazy. Read that. Read Daniel and the Lion's Den. 
you go to the verses where it's located. Read it or listen to it, whichever one. If you got the Bible app, you can listen to it. Or if you want to just open your Bible and read it, read it. But please read the whole story and put in the comments if you read it. Okay, I'll see y'all in a little bit. All right, y'all, so I managed to work out, managed to eat. So I just decided that this weekend, um, I've been doing good for since really September. But here and there, I have things, y'all. I have not been just only eating strict food for seven months. I haven't. I eat things sometimes when I want them. But I'm determined for the month of April. This is what I'm hoping. I hope I can stick to it. In April, I really just want to only cook only eat foods i cook and not not eat out not eat any junk food for the whole month of april i want to try that so bad just like really 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 eat clean april I go to the doctor may 13th and I, I don't know what i'm gonna be when i get there but i'm hoping by june 1st it's like mom it's my mama talking all out yeah she's talking but loud loudly but so i'm just Hoping that I can do it. I'm about to take down this Christmas tree. About to clean up. Y'all, I'm tired. I ate. I didn't get a nap. I'm just going to probably try to go to bed early tonight, I guess. Because I don't need to lay down and take no nap. I need to get up and clean up my house. My house is a mess. And I need to also do my front porch. Um, because here it is, Good Friday. And I still got Christmas stuff outside. Like, what am I doing? Outside and inside. So, we're going to get this stuff started today, and hopefully I can show y'all what I have done, okay? And my phone is about to die. Bye. What you're not going to do is come for this one. Is that? Neither one of y'all. And y'all know who I'm talking to. So the two who I'm talking about know who I'm talking about. I, I, I got them together, though. Thank good. I'm proud of you. But me and Lay about to go inside of TJ Maxx really quick, y'all. This is a quick trip. I'm just doing like a, you know, I got to clean my house real quick. You know when you like clean up and you just need a couple things to help you clean up? That's what I'm about to do right now. So I'm about to run into Jam Mash real quick and then go get me some frozen yogurt and then go home and clean up my house. Y'all want to go with me? Okay. Because people... No, you need to take it and get a purse. How much? Oh, uh, okay. Oh, let me put my card in there. What do you mean do I have a purse? You know I got a purse. Y'all, so look what just got zipped up, baby. Mind your business. Lay, what's wrong with you? I know what she's talking about, y'all, but look what we did. Lay. What's up, y'all? So, look. It's down. Mama T got that Christmas tree down. The Christmas decorations down. Everything's looking really pretty on this side. I'm so grateful to the Lord for that. Somehow, Mama T got some little bug. I've been sick all night, all morning. And I had to cancel my brunch. that I was going to film and record me making for my family. I was going to make um, waffles and um, French toast, potatoes, bacon sausage um I was gonna possibly make some fried chicken um some shrimp and grits i was gonna do the works and i just got so sick and i and i i have a co-worker who makes desserts and i was gonna go get like everybody a jar because he, he's selling these little jars um i'm gonna put his instagram right here um he sells desserts and let me tell you something i tasted this man's dessert amazing amazing he made this strawberry shortcake or strawberry crunch cupcake best cupcake i think i ever had it was amazing y'all and i'm not just saying that like it was it was amazing that's just the truth it was amazing it was delicious it was it was bomb 
But I've been straightening up my home, trying to get stuff together for my brunch that I just had to cancel. I literally just called my brother and sister. Well, Tracy and Kevin, because I have other siblings, but Tracy and Kevin were coming over. My mama, probably my nephew, well, my nephew had to go to work. So probably Aaron, Salam and Ethan, and probably Lay too. And I was going to, you know, try to cook for them, but I don't feel well. And I don't feel like comfortable with cooking while you run into the bathroom. That's kind of disgusting. So I was like, y'all still welcome to come over. I'm going to still try to go get them there. Their, I'm going to go get them their little jars because I told my coworker I was going there. So hopefully I can just go get that real quick, come on back home. And I said, maybe, you know, we can just get something to eat and we can just eat here, um, which my stomach feels bad. I, I'm not hungry at all. I have no appetite for nothing. I don't, the thought of food make me feel sick because I don't feel well. But I'm still going to try to straighten up my house. I was going back there to do my bathroom next, but my mom was like, let me do the bathroom. Since you don't feel well, she says she's going to do the bathroom, and I'm so grateful. So all I'm doing is sipping on some water, and it is Saturday, the day before Easter. And hopefully, since my mama says she's going to do the bathroom, I'm going to try to go do my, my porch. After I get the little stuff from him, I'm going to come back and do my front porch because I just, I got to get that Christmas stuff off my porch. I got to, y'all, because we got it out of here. I put that little reef up, but it's not looking cute. Y'all look at Remington. <laughs> Look at baby Remy growing up. And she pretty. But um, that's Tanya and Rick, baby. But I'm about to throw on some clothes real quick so I can head out. My stomach feeling bloated. Like it is it's like bloated, like bloated, bloated. Like I just don't feel well. And like who wants to feel bad? <laughs> Like, you be feeling so good during the work week, but sometimes, like, either now the weather is gorgeous, beautiful day outside, beautiful day, and I feel like this. Then my niece, I think, I don't know if she, she might not be home, but she was like, you going to the gym? Oh, I got to finish the kitchen. It's really, it's, it's a little bit of dishes in there, and I got to put that stuff up, but, like, I promise you, everything is looking much better than it was looking. Um, I'm trying to do a little bit more because next week I'm going to be going hard in the gym so i just wanted to get you know my bathroom clean my kitchen my living room you know just get this stuff straightened up so next week when i'm at work and going to the gym it don't look how it's been looking <sighs> i haven't bought new rugs for my bathroom i bought some new candles let me show you my candles so me and lay went to we went to tj Maxx yesterday as y'all saw i bought this candle it smells really good this is the one that i'm smelling right now i'm glad i bought it because i don't really smell these two these fresh cut flowers and peony apple. I don't smell them at all. I will not be buying Charming Farmhouse candles anymore. Normally DW candles I can smell. But I don't really smell these. I don't know why. But those are my yellow pants I wore last week. I will be washing them. There's a couple of clothes on the floor. I'm, I was literally in the middle of putting all these dishes up. They're clean. Those, those right there are clean. Those are clean. I'm about to put those up. But, um... And my laundry room is not clean, but we're going to worry about that later. But, oh, yeah. Mama T about to go. I got to take this off. Got to comb this hair because I got to go. But I'm out. They are still doing this. Hold on. Is Salam on the back of the chair with Pretty Grandma? Y'all, they are not still doing this. What is she doing? Oh, she got off of it. Oh, they, okay, they're being a blessing to somebody. Please pull up some more. Oh, she got, right, she got right in my way. I was trying to record my daughter. She could. These two people are weirdos. Please get that picture of me. She was little doing it. What is wrong with y'all? What the heck is wrong? Wow, what is? 
Yeah, no paparazzi. What is wrong? Um, Y'all still doing this? Y'all look, it worked out with me. Happy Monday, y'all. I'm literally just finished working out. I only stayed for an hour. I uh, can't do as long because I be needing to be home a little bit earlier than eight. So I'm leaving now. About to go home and cook me some dinner real quick because I did not meal prep yesterday. I'm making some salmon and some broccoli. And I will probably talk to y'all for a little bit when I get home because I'm gonna try to get this video out um, early early this week like probably won't be maybe, maybe by Wednesday maybe I can see where I'm at and hopefully get out by Wednesday okay so I hope y'all had a wonderful Monday okay I'm trying y'all I'm trying all right you guys it is almost 11 o'clock it's Monday night April the 1st I hope y'all had a wonderful wonderful Monday Thank you for watching my video. If you stayed this far to the end, I want y'all to leave a full moon. I just want a full moon. Hopefully they have an emoji full moon. A moon or a sun or something, I don't know. But I really want a moon. It doesn't have to be full. If they had a moon or a sun, leave that at the end of the video if you stayed this far. Thank you so much for watching, y'all. I am super duper tired. I was trying to get this video out to y'all. Um, this week earlier than I did the last time. Last time I waited so long, like three weeks or two weeks. Um, it's seven days today. I posted a week ago today. My goal was to try to get it out today, but it's just not, it didn't happen. I edited like five or six minutes after I got out of the gym. Y'all know I go to the gym when I get off work. Working out is so important to me. I have to work out and then I have to eat and take a shower and it's 11 o'clock and I edited literally probably six minutes of it and I'm about to go to bed and I gotta go to work tomorrow and do the same thing over. I'm gonna try to edit some of it on my lunch break. I'm gonna try to get it out for y'all Wednesday, the um, maybe the third. So that's my goal. Hopefully I make it. Um, I did like a little fun um, story dump, photo dump, not story dump. Well, it was, it's on my story, so, but it's a photo dump. But I'm gonna try to do those every month and just show y'all different pictures and things I do throughout the month. I know it's just silly, but it's fun. But I decided to put it on my story instead of my, um, you know, just, you know, where the pictures go. So go ahead and don't forget to leave that emoji for me, a moon or sun or something. I love you guys with all of my heart. I really, really do. May God bless and keep each and every one of you guys. Make sure y'all are reading the word. Make sure y'all are studying the word of God. Make sure, you, make sure you are making a point to be obedient followers of Christ, okay? Doesn't mean we're going to be perfect, but make it a point to be obedient, you know? Make it a point to do the right thing. Um, because the Bible says that if we love Christ, we will honor him and we will, you know, follow his word. And we will, you know, do the right things. Like I said, doesn't mean you're going to be perfect, but we should really try to um, be obedient and bless the Lord by that way. I love y'all. <laughs> Have a good night. I'm sleepy. Say your prayers. Good night.